Welcome to another Cyber Awareness Moment. We're going to be sharing with you why it's very important that you have a VPN coming up. Frank, I know that you're all about cyber uh, security. And uh, right now with the pandemic that we are sometimes at home, sometimes we are in uh, Starbucks or in Panera Bread or in wherever we are, or if we're traveling, we have to be connecting to different networks. Yeah. And uh, it is absolutely critical to know why it's so important to have VPNs. So can you let us know a little bit about it? I think the primary message I'd like to get across on this video, Ernesto, is that the average person needs the VPN just like the person that travels extensively, okay? And, and what I mean by that is, is that um, we've all been in situations, whether we go to a local holiday inn on travel, holiday season coming up, uh, sometimes we're at a Panera Bread or a Starbucks or a local coffee shop, and we use the public Wi-Fi. It's not safe. It's not safe. A VPN, which stands for Virtual Private Network in simplicity, it means that instead of your message leaving your laptop or your cell phone or your iPad or your tablet and bouncing around from the, you know, the, the service providers and it goes from your device to the end device and nobody sees it. It's like all the information goes in a tunnel. Your private network. Companies have it. We as individuals should have it, especially with the affordability of it. That is correct. I mean, for a couple of dollars a month, you can actually have a service, right? Well, actually, they can get it for free, okay? Oh. Um, because uh, now that would be like to, to get you to use it. So when I say it's for free, it will be limited as far as how much bandwidth you can have, how much traffic you can send. But even if you pay for it, Ernesto, it's only a couple dollars, two, three dollars. And, and, and there's some really good ones out there. And uh, there'll be even better ones uh, that are enhancing what they offer. Yeah, the challenge is this is only a piece of the puzzle. That doesn't mean that if you're connected to a VPN, you're going to be secure from a hack. No. And uh, right now, in this uh, pandemic economy that we're living right now, how can organizations protect themselves and protect their employees uh, in order for them to be safe against uh, cyber crooks or identity theft? You know, for the last 15 years, what I've told all the corporations and the associations and, and, and governments of countries is that you have to have heightened awareness as to how identity theft is impacting not only the corporation, Ernesto, but the individual employee. Because the more the employee understands on their level about protecting their own digital DNA, right? New word for a lot of people, digital DNA, which is everything connected to us in this cyber world. We need to have that heightened awareness. So companies are urged to continue with what they're doing with the hardware, the software, and the IT departments. Critical. But it's the employees that are responsible for 80% of the breaches involve human error because they let their guard down. So it's situational awareness is what it is. So how would you uh, recommend that uh, people actually get this kind of information? Because it's a growing, it's a growing uh, problem. Yeah. And that's why we put together a whole series that, that uh, you, you know, you and I started talking about it in Dubai uh, three years ago. And, and, and as you saw that it just exploded, uh, especially with the pandemic, um, you've helped me to put a, a lot of our content on uh, online that companies can feed it to their employees because uh, think about it um, the the old days of having you know 90 percent of the employees in one big building are no longer there the employees are now remote so in this work from home stay from home remote era it's increased the probability of a breach and so we can now deliver that same training even though we don't have everybody in one room, we can send it to them through webinars, staff development days. And we've even, uh, Ernesto, got it so that it's living out there 24 by 7. That's how yeah. business can use it. That is great. And I know that this is a complimentary 
uh, training. Therefore, if you would like to protect your organization, make sure that uh, there's no cyber threats uh, in your business, make sure to get in touch with us.